Hello, everyone. I bring you warm greetings from Bangladesh. I praise God for the opportunity to witness to him. Today, I want to draw your attention to a powerful message found in the book of Hebrews, chapter 12, verses 1 and 2. The passage says, Wherefore, let us lay aside every weight and the sin which doth so easily beset us, and let us run with patience the race that is set before us, looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith. These words provide us with guidance and encouragement in our spiritual journey. We are called to lay aside every weight and sin that easily entangles us, hindering our progress in the race of life. The Apostle Paul is reminding us of the importance of shedding the burdens that hold us back. He is reminding us of the significance of releasing the heavy loads that hinder our progress. Now, what are these weights that Paul talks about? The spirit of prophecy help us understand this. Ellen White says, the weights are the evil habits and practices we have formed by following our own natural dispositions. That is from Bible Commentary, Volume 7, page 934. These habits deeply ingrained within us can hinder our spiritual growth and distance us from God. However, we are not left without hope. When we come to the foot of the cross, we are given the opportunity to lay down all our old sinful habits and practices. It is at the cross that we surrender our rights to live according to our own ways and choose to live solely for God, relying on his power to transform our lives. Through the sacrifice of Jesus, we find the strength and motivation to let go of the things that weighed us down. Ellen White, in her book, In Heavenly Places, says, Each soul inherits certain and Christ-like traits of character. It is the grand and noble work of a lifetime to keep under control these tendencies to wrong. It is the little things that cross our path that are likely to cause us to lose our power of self-control. Let us remember that this process is not a one-time event, but it is a lifelong journey. We need to surrender our lives daily to the Holy Spirit because we cannot achieve a daily victory in our own strength. We need the help of the Holy Spirit to navigate life's challenges make wise decisions in overcome spiritual battles. Brothers and sisters, as we run this race of faith, let us fix our eyes on Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith. He is our ultimate example and source of strength. Through the help of the Holy Spirit, let us imitate his character, relying on his grace to transform us from within. And through the help of the Holy Spirit, we can overcome the weights that hinder us. And we can experience the freedom and joy of living a life fully surrendered to God. As we continue on this journey, let us lay aside every weight and sin. Let us run with patience, endurance, 
in and wavering faith, knowing that our eyes are fixed on Jesus. May we continually seek his guidance and rely on his power to help us overcome the tendencies to wrong. And may the transformation in our lives be a testimony to his amazing grace and love. May God bless you abundantly as you run this race with perseverance. Amen. Let us pray. Our gracious and merciful, loving Father, thank you, Lord, for the Holy Spirit to help us to have a daily victory and to lay aside all the weights, our old habits, and sin. And as we go out today, help us to be a blessing. Help us to be a living testimony to the people around us. I pray because we believe in your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining with me today. And may God bless you. This is my prayer.